I made up the other night. Uh, I had some people ask how it was going to be wired and for some pictures and I figured it might be easier just to do a little video. So there is the panel with the three switches to control the left side rear camera and right side cameras and the monitor. Now the tops of the switches are the ground connections and as you can see they are all ganged together and they will come across and all of the ground power grounds for the camera for the monitor will come back to here and then this will be attached to my common dashboard ground and that will com complete all of the ground connections for power source we have this neat little power takeoff which will just plug into the fuse box the wires come back they feed into the bottom of the three lugs on the switches and again they're ganged all the way across and that supplies the power source to all of the switches now off the center you'll see these wires coming off of the switch they are the power for the camera will be the red wire and the off color switch or off color wire is the trigger switch for the monitor and they will all come back there this heavy wire off this end switch is going to be the power source feed going over to power the monitor. Pretty straightforward and in actual fact these little gauge wires here are actually a little bit bigger than the wires that came on the power feed cable for the actual camera. So they should be able to supply enough current and being that size that they are.